Hey there, Valley View. This is Principal Jeremy Jones coming with your weekly update. Just wanting to let you know kind of what to expect for the upcoming week and as we move forward towards the end of the year. Obviously, I still hate that we're not able to all be at school together. Uh, I'm currently obviously in one of the rooms at Valley View. And for my students out there, let's see if you recognize the mural that's back on the wall and where I'm located at. But uh, I just want to let you know that even though we're not able to be here on campus, that we are still going to continue to work hard on our remote learning. Uh, the past week, you know, we've been encouraging that if you have internet access for your instruction for the week to be doing iReady Math and iReady Reading. And you guys went above and beyond. We saw a 40% increase in the amount of students that were doing that online instruction. Now, if for some reason you don't have internet access or you have a device that's able to access the iReady material, notice that the packets will be out front starting tomorrow. Those will also be available on the buses and this will still get you all the core needs that we need to be doing, the things that we want our students to be focusing on right now academically, because we are still in school. Even though you're not here on campus, we are still wanting to teach and to grow and to educate our students. Now, parents, something that I'm gonna be doing in next week's principal update is that I wanna answer any questions that you might have. We're gonna be pushing out information of what the next four weeks at school are gonna look like. We're gonna share with you how you're gonna be able to get your child's items that last week and also be communicating some different celebrations that'll be taking place over the summer. Uh, I know the county just announced that they're looking at having graduations in June. And so we're gonna be following a similar schedule and that information will be pushed out. But there might be all kinds of other question things that we haven't thought through yet that I wanna take the time to answer. So next week in our principal's update, I'm gonna answer questions that you send in to me during the current week. So anything that you would like to ask me, that you would like to be addressed, that you would like to be answered, if you will shoot that to jjones at bradleyschools.org. And then I will be so happy to uh, try to get some direction and some information out there to you because this has been a time to where there's been a lot of questions. All right, everybody, here's our last little bit. We wanna give our big shout outs real quick. Top AR point earners, once again, third through fifth grade, Laura Ratcliffe, very good job. Continuing to dominate there. And then for our kindergarten through second grade, we have a new individual, it is Chloe Turner. Chloe Turner, very good job, super proud of you. Now, little brother is pretty close, so you better watch out, Chloe. But uh, like we said, we're keeping up with who's winning and we're gonna get some prizes out there to you whenever we kind of get back to getting stuff handed back. Also our house points real quick, if you recognize the mural behind me here, look at that bear, just so happy. And so our top house point earner for this week is Panda Bears. Panda Bears, very good job, 388 points, very proud of you. Remember guys, you can earn those points by doing your assignments, having mom and dad kind of report that to Kathy Carter also, uh, Math Ninja AR points, and then helping out around the house. One last thing, we just want to remind everybody that yearbooks are on sale. There was a link that was sent out, and your teachers will be pushing that out again this week. And so for $25, you can uh, purchase a yearbook, and we'll get that delivered to you, okay? All right. All right, guys, here we are. We're at another location, and just want to remind you about a couple things. Our instruction packets are going to be outside, and I'm going to show those to you. And then I'm going to share something with you that's on our campus right here that uh, it's a little bit of encouragement. So if you'll come out this way here with me. Now, let me remind you that if you need to pick up an instruction packet, you can get it off the table over here. And then also, we are currently collecting our library books, and so you can return them in the bin. And Ms. Stallings will be giving you some information with that. Now, here's a little treat for you, just real quick. Um, I'm gonna show you our, I think they're called knockout rose bushes. Look over here. In full bloom. Amazing stuff right there, okay? And here's what I like to think about whenever I look at those. You know, what it took to create this is there had to be some cloudy days, right? There had to be days when the rain would come and would feed them and produce such a beautiful image. And the reality is, is that we're currently in the middle of some, you know, stormy days. We don't fully understand what's going on. But we believe that as we continue to work hard, as you work hard as students, and as we work hard as teachers and educators here, that we're going to have a day where some beautiful things are going to be produced out of it. So thank you for all you do. Proud of you. And remember, go Cubs. See you guys. Bye.